Hey guys, hey, how are y'all? Hey, with the twist. How are you? I'm good. Stan good Pickett, to nice to meet you. you. This is Peyton. She's going to be the artist Peyton. for today. Hey, and I'm Lisa. Hey, Lisa. And you? we have your apron ready. You brought your snacks, I see. Well, I understand that it's BYOB. So it is. Just, and you know, bring well. bring your goodies. Why painting with the twist? In 2012, we had a son that was killed tragically in a motorcycle accident. A friend said, let's go paint. I'm like, I don't paint, but I'll go paint. And I found that it was very relaxing and therapeutic. So Brian and I went back several times and we just kind of got it in our spirit that, you know, this might be something God's leading us to do. And we prayed and prayed. And um, within a year, we decided to go ahead and take a step of faith. And we opened in 2013. Well, listen, small business, if you've been here six years and you're still open, you're, there, there's some success to that. And I think that's great. I'm going to show you how to set up a class like I would do it. And you can actually grab these two and we'll okay. set them up, uh, crisscross them like that. That way they have enough room. Got to have room on the right. Room on the right. That way, if they're a group of four, they can talk amongst each other. Okay. Grab a cup and set it right beside that napkin. And all you have left are brushes. And this is Big Papa. So you just set Big Papa. Big Papa. Big okay. Papa on our napkins. You only get one brush? We, we usually have two. Okay, we have two, good. But sometimes we don't give our little bitties out yeah. until the very end because they'll want to do the whole painting with a little bitty. So every class you'll have a paint sheet and this is something the artist goes by. I usually start with what's going to be the basis of everything. So our background is going to be white. And there's a talent to it. There is. You just got to... <laughs> what if they get on it like that? That's okay. That's okay? Yes, that's okay. We're going to be mixing anyway. I noticed on that it's, it said a drawing. Do you have it pre-drawn? So for animals, shoes, and people, we normally pre- Wait a minute. Animals, shoes, shoes and people. And people. Okay. <laughs> we do have a lot of high heel paintings. <laughs> <laughs> animals, shoes, and people. Not even going to ask. Okay. <laughs> we want you to have fun here, and if you're stressing out about drawing a person, it's not going to be that fun. We're going to paint the um, Resist All Arena today. Let's go paint. Tell me what it is that I'm going to do to finish this up. Okay, so we are going to put our clouds in our sky. That way it gives more of a, a bright look. You'll want to dip your brush into a little bit of blue. Okay. And a little bit of white. Okay. At the same time, we double Ooh, it mix here. it up. This is kind of going to be the shape of your cloud first. So if I want a little, a little rounded cloud here, I can yeah. just... Mm-hmm. If you want to bring out tails on your cloud, you can. I always like clouds with tails. Uh -huh. Okay. That so. way you can see things. Yeah, there you go. So you'll see the professional ones and the one I did. I like that. They look good. I just want to tell you how much fun I've had today, how relaxed I am from being, having a chance to come in here and paint, uh, and just another very successful small business week, and we hope you the you. best of success in the future. Appreciate that. Thanks so much.